A single engine plane with engine problems avoids rush hour traffic and makes an emergency landing on a busy Manatee Highway. There were no injuries, but the scene attracted plenty of attention from drivers. SNN's Grant Boxleitner was there. Initial thought was hoping he was all right. It was an unusual sight during Friday rush hour traffic. A Cessna plane along US 301 near Whitfield Avenue after making an emergency landing on the highway. It came out of St. Pete. I don't know if that's the home base, but that's where he came from. He's not based here at Sarasota. SRQ President Rick Piccolo says on final approach, the engine started sputtering at 900 feet, about a half mile from the airport. Christy Sinkler is the comptroller at nearby Custom Communications. Yeah, it was a strange thing to see it on the road on 9-11. It was concerning, it's first thought. SRQ operations manager Lionel Gilbert explains how the plane made its final trek to the airport. Well, the airplane is not damaged, so they're going to be able to tow it back with a regular tow, plane, um, tow tug back to the airport. We tried to talk to the pilot as he was leaving the scene. Are you glad you're safe, sir? But he wanted no part of an interview. It looked like really no damage anywhere, so that was, he was one lucky guy. Reporting in Manatee County, Grant Boxleitner, SNN Suncoast News Network. Thomas Frick was the pilot of the aircraft and records show the plane is owned by Skycatcher LLC in Tampa. The FAA is investigating the incident.